Hi, my name is Amanda Steyer, and I have a blog called Randy Cahoots. I heard about something to chew on when it was just an idea that Leisha and Sally had um, that they were so excited and so passionate about, and it's been wonderful to see it come to fruition. I am mom to five homeschooled children, four of whom are teenagers and one who is 10. Uh, two of them are on the autism spectrum. My 10-year-old has um, a genetic collagen disorder, which causes her all sorts of physical issues. Um, so life in her house is very interesting. I began my blog seven or eight years ago when I was diagnosed with psoriatic arthritis and spondylitis and needed a way to keep my family updated as to what uh, my health condition was, what I was going through in life, and also as a way to process living with chronic illness and in chronic pain. Um, along the way, I didn't really pay attention to how many people were reading my blog. I just kind of assumed that it was only family members and maybe a few friends. Um, several years down the road, I clicked on the stats button and was shocked to see that there were like 40 people reading my blog. And now I'm still shocked to see that there are 80 people reading my blog. My blog is mostly as I said, for me processing life. Um, my style of writing is just kind of sitting down and pouring out what is in my brain and in my heart. Um, I minimally edit my, blog, my blogs and just kind of post them. I like to add photography. Um, I'm a very visual person. And in the course of writing my blogs and in the course of living with um, chronic pain due to the fact that I can't take pain medications um, because of liver issues that I have um, and with things that I've been through with my children and their issues and everything over the course of the, the years that I've been writing. Um, I have actually grown in my faith through my writing. Um, my writing has helped me kind of invite God into the conversation and into my life more fully. When I was diagnosed, my initial reaction was not why me, it was thank God. Because I finally had answers. I finally had a doctor who was telling me that I wasn't crazy and I wasn't imagining all the pain that I was in. And since then, that's kind of the attitude that I've had when living life is... God is with me and God comforts me and God brings so much joy to my life. I have five amazing children plus whatever other teenagers or small children um, are in my house on any particular day. And even though I can't do a lot of the things that I used to be able to do, I still have a full life um, because having all these illnesses and being able to write through them has helped me focus on what's really important in life. It's helped me to slow down and open my eyes to all the wonderful things that God has provided. So again, my blog is Randy Cahoots. It's randycahoots.blogspot.com. I write about family and faith and the realness of living with chronic illness and, you know, the joys through the hardships. Um, I was having a discussion with a friend the other day in which they pointed out that my blog is, is kind of a nevertheless blog where a lot of times I start out saying, these are the struggles that I have. Nevertheless, God provides and God gets me through all of this and these are the joys that come out of all of this so I write about a little bit of everything I don't write every day um, I do try it's Advent I do try to write every day in Advent um, there are times that I am too ill to write or too busy with children and theater and church and all of those things so um, thank you for watching my video and um, I can't wait to see you over on my blog